Good afternoon. Welcome back, or welcome. Uh, I've come to a place called Stover Country Park in Devon. It's half term, so it's quite busy here, or well, the car park was very busy anyway. So there are going to be a lot of people about here. Sort of like uh, a nature reserve, I suppose. Like there's a big uh, lake with birds and ducks, and walk around it. So trees, woodland, um, and all that type of thing. So not sort of sure, I've been here before, but not sort of sure what I'm going to capture today. So we just have to have a wander around and see what we can find, see what we can get. So here we go. I won't lie, I am struggling. Um, I've walked around probably about 80% of it. Haven't really come across anything that takes my eye at the moment. I have just uh, taken a shot from here. You might not be able to see it, but the, the trees where you can see the, the long uh, trunks there and the reflecting, although the wind has picked up quite a bit. So most of the water is, is too ripply uh, but we'll see we'll see how it comes out it's really busy it's half term lots of people about with their kids, uh, people walking their dogs. So I would advise coming here, um, come either early morning or, or late evening or not during half term and possibly stay away from the weekends if possible, if you want the place more to yourself that is. It's not such a big deal taking photos depending on what you're photographing. Um, but as most of the uh, vloggers know it's not great uh, vlogging around with lots of people around um, so I'm mostly doing it when there's a quiet patch but anyway I'm going to continue the rest of the walk around see what else I can get hopefully the sun not the sun the wind sorry dies down a bit reflections might be a bit better on the water although the sky is just uh, clear blue sky with no clouds so uh, that's not very good um, for my shots but we'll see anyway I'm gonna continue my walk well I've uh, walked around a bit and uh, got a few shots while I was uh, walking around didn't really uh, vlog any of the shots because like I said it's it's really busy here and not just the fact of talking with people walking past and that, but with them talking and kids making a lot of noise, it just would have made the video unusable really. So what I'll do is put the any shots up that I did get at the end. Like I said, conditions aren't ideal here today. It's a nice location, you know, you've got lots of different environments here, but one where you really want to come when it's quieter and also and there's some interest in the sky. Lots of different bird varieties here if, if you like uh, uh, taking shots of birds. So that, that's good. I was falling into the trap again, uh, like it's easy to do of coming out because you're coming out 
to get shots as well as uh, you know get out in nature and have a walk in that you know ideally you do want to get some shots as well and I was sort of like thinking again you know like I said before you know, I'm not really getting the shots I wanted my creativity's down a bit I think but I, I walked past on the path by the by the lake there's a, a young woman with a old man he was in a pushchair wheelchair not pushchair that would have been a baby that was when he was younger and uh, now he's older um, he's in a wheelchair and a blanket over his lap and um, you know it, it was his daughter because I heard as I was walking past she called him dad and that and it's and it just you know made me think you know that'd be the sort of thing I want to do when I'm older my, my daughter is all bringing me out into nature to to take it all in you know but it's like just get out and do things while you're young and enjoy going places and doing things while you're young and while you can you know that's that's really a message I want to get across in this video and luckily I think I've, I've got a daughter that would, that would take me out and push me around to these places when I need to she comes out with me occasionally uh, she's grown woman now, early 20s um, but she comes out, gets out in nature with me uh, so so I've, I've got her to push me around when I need to I'm running short of time again now I would advise um, I'm not sure, I put on two, I think there's like two hours parking and or sort of like all day sunrise to sunset um, I put on two hours which was uh, 150, not sure how long the whole day one was but I would advise putting on the whole day. I mean, two hours isn't enough, really. I mean, I've had to walk around the lake area, um, but there are loads of paths off into wooded areas and woodland, which I didn't really have time to explore. So, like I said, I, I would put on the... I don't think it was too much more, so I would put on that so you've got more time to explore. There is, there are toilets here as well, and the entrance where the car parks. So there are facilities here. So, anyways, it's, it's been a, a short one. Probably uh, not as good as, as, as some of my videos. Um, hopefully, you've enjoyed it still, though. Like I said, it's a shame I couldn't sort of vlog too much. So you sort of haven't really seen too much of the area um, as much as I'd like, or, or talk through the shots. But, you know, I've, I've got out, I've got a bit of footage, I've got some shots. Nothing that's going to be that good, but, you know, it's all practice and experience and getting out there. A beautiful day, it's, it's lovely and sunny, nice and warm, and it's sort of um, end of October, so... Enjoying the weather, getting out while I can, like I said, so... Hope to see you back on the next one. Please subscribe if you haven't done already. Uh, hit that bell. Uh, so you get notified when I uh, post videos and uh, comment below at the moment I'm answering and replying to all comments I get so um, please do it's good to connect and I'll uh, see you in the next one